quarantine. Um, it was it felt a little comforting because you, you used to guard them in practice when we were here. We came in together. Um, so looking over and you knowing exactly who he is, it kind of gave me that comfort level of I know exactly what he's probably going to do and that shoot from deep. Um, but it, it was good to see him, man, and I told him at the end of the game. Um, I'm just so proud of his success and, uh, and the decision that we, he made. I, I, he will always be a part of our family, and uh, he's such a great guy. His family's such a great, a great family, and uh, I'm just, I just wish him luck and the best this time to come. From an emotional standpoint, when you broke the finger, just when you get ready to come back, then your appendix happened. Were you like, what's going to happen next? I can't believe this is going on. Did you ever get down about that? No. I knew what was going to happen next, and I was going to be a recovery and get back to playing. So um, I had a positive mindset about it. Uh, the whole time, and uh, one thing that I always kept telling myself is control the controllables. I can't control my pinky getting broken. I can't control my appendix. Um, I just had all I can do is control the recovery process and stay positive and uh, let it take its course.